TOPOR topological router, is an EDA program developed and maintained by the Russian company Aremex. It is dedicated to laying out a printed circuit board PCB. The current version is 6.3.17875 as of the 20th of September 2017. It features a powerful autorouter and a set of tools intended to reduce the amount of effort needed for manual routing of a PCB. The most recognizable feature of Topor is the absence of preferred routing directions, which results in unusual looking PCBs. Topic History Work on a flexible topological router began in 1988, when it became clear that the traditional methods of routing with regular and irregular grids grid-based routers and shape-based routers and consecutive wiring with locked-down geometry were a dead-end solution. 1996 saw the release of the first version of a topological router that actually came to be used by industrial enterprises. In 2002, the Freestyle Router FSR by Dial Engineering, Dial Engineering ran under DOS and successfully routed dual-layer boards, interfacing with PCAD. This early router showed the advantages of an innovative approach to routing and high efficiency of the models, algorithms, and software implementation. A 1.44 MB floppy disk was enough for the program and accompanying examples. The company also announced plans to commercially release a freestyle suite for Windows later the year. The last version of FSR for DOS, consisting of the router named Speedway and the layout editor named Freestyle was version 1.6 as of the 26th of September 2003, the 1st of November 2003, the first Windows version of the topological router was released in 2001 and renamed to Topor. Topol 1.03 was available on 26 September 2003 and distributed through Electrade. Electric the program routed not only dual-layer but also multi-layer printed circuit boards. Topol was developed by a group called the Freestyle Team, supervised by Sergei J. Luzin, Yurovich Sergei Luzin with Oleg B. Polobasov, Oleg Borisovich Polobasov as initial FSR developer, as well as Paul I. Dmitriev, Pavel Ivanovich Dmitriev, Gevorg S. Petrosian, Gevorg Samvelovich Petrosian, Michael S. Luzin, Mihail Sergeyevich Luzin, and Andrew A. Lysenko. Andre Alexandrovich Lysenko. Version 3.0 was released in 2006. The software was commercially distributed by Prosoft SPB, Prosoft SPB in 2007. Topor 4.0 added support to import, export DSN design and SES session files. Since Topor 4.1 the software is further developed and maintained by Aremex, Ltd. <laughs> <laughs> Features Topor can be used as an external autorouter for third-party layout editors or in conjunction with Aremex's own schematic capture and layout editor Delta Design DD. Topor imports input in Delta Design's FST format, as Spectra, Electra-compatible DSN design files, or in PCAD PCB ASCII 2000, 2002, 2004, PADS PCB ASCII 3.5, 4.0, 5.0, 2005 or Eagle BRDXML formats 6, X. 
The resulting boards can be exported into Spectra, Electra SES session files, DXF, Gerber, PCAD PCB ASCII 2000, 2002, 2004, PADS PCB ASCII 3.5, 4.0, 5.0, 2005 .0. Routing of the wiring topology is done automatically and flexibly, angles are not limited to 90 degrees and 45 degrees. Efficient use of PCB space and absence of preferred routing directions in layers considerably reduces electromagnetic crosstalk. Top or routes all connections, even if this entails violating design constraints. Such violations can be automatically corrected later. When objects such as components and vias are moved around, wire length and shape are optimized automatically with appropriate clearance. The user is free to choose from two ways to calculate the wire shape, with or without arcs. The first method involves wires consisting of lines only. The other makes wires keep appropriate clearance when circling around pads, it consists of arcs and lines. Topor simultaneously optimizes several alternative variants of the layout. Variants with the worst parameters per total wire length and number of vias will be removed. Topor has an automatic component placement feature. The procedure can be used both for all components of the board and only for components in a specific area. It is not comparable to the quality of the manual placement, but it can be used as a preparation step for manual placement. The minimum and desired clearances for each net can be specified. Topor automatically supports trace necking, that is, it reduces the width of a wire that approaches a narrow pad or one with a diameter that is less than the width of the wire, or when it passes through bottlenecks for example, between the pads of a component. Wire-to-pad transitions use teardrop-style smoothing. The use of this procedure at the design stage helps avoid violations in design rule checking when teardrops are added in the CAM editor. Topor can recognize ball grid array BGA component areas and apply a special strategy for routing them. This helps reduce the number of vias, the density of connections, and in some cases the number of routing layers. A special algorithm is used for routing single layer boards minimizing the number of interlayer junctions or to find a single layer routing. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Similar solutions. The layout program PCB of the Geda suite includes a similar topological autorouter named Toporouter, which was written by Anthony Blake in a Google-funded open-source project mentored by DJ Delory in 2008. It is mostly based on an implementation of the algorithms described in Tal Dian's 1997 PhD thesis, Rubber Band Based Topological Router. This router has meanwhile been adapted for use with the open source KiCad project as well. Topic See also Comparison of EDA software List of free electronic circuit simulators equals equals notes <laughs>